Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon. I am here with Geeky Sparkles. Hello. Uh, I don't know what we're looking at here. We're looking at the uh, DC League of Super Pets Justice League, the human characters. Okay. And we're looking at Cyborg in particular. Well, look, it's balanced. Because, you know, by the big shoulder and then the big hair. Oh, my God. Okay, so we're going to talk about this because even though the designs have been out there for a couple of months now, people are just starting to catch on that they look pretty not good. Mm. Uh, especially Cyborg. Cyborg looks like uh, Cynthia from Rugrats. <laughs> you okay. know, where her hair is like all half. Look, and it's it's Owlman. It's Owlman. He goes, who? Who? I am the knight. Who? Who? Anyway, let's talk about this. Before we get into it any further, please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. Over 272,000 subs. I'm sorry. I know what. Woohoo. Sorry. I'm just looking at his face, and he looks like an owl or uh, that shit himself. Look at him. He's an just owl like, that shit himself. Look, look, his eyes are like, you know, like, like they look like owl eyes. But then he has this look at his face like, oops. Oops. They took a poop. Yeah, oops. Uh, that that pretty much describes this. People not liking these designs. Again, this is for a kids movie, a kids movie based mainly on the uh, the super pets. Oh, but how dare they have Wonder Woman in an outfit like that? I know. I, I thought she would have her. I thought she'd have her pants, pants on. Actually, I think the boots are pretty cool. Actually, the boots aren't bad. I like the boots. She's not bad. Um, but yeah, so these designs have been out there for. A couple of months now, these are the human characters. Uh, people starting to realize that freaking Cyborg looks awful. And it's interesting, they have different posters here, right? So we got like Ace and, um, you know, the Bat Dog and. and uh, I like you seeing his Metro Man with Superman. He looks like Metro Man. He does look like Metro And if you look at, if you look at Cyborg, Cyborg looks like the, the, the redhead guy they turned into, a, um, into the Bat Villain. Kind of, oh, in yeah, the face, yeah, yeah. he kind of looks like that. Kind of. Um, it's interesting, though. The Green Lantern is, I believe, the uh, the female Latina Green Lantern that Ethan Van Skyver oh, co-created. Oh, well, if that's the case, that's going to ruin some narratives out there, isn't it? I know, right? How, how dare we get representation, but it came from EVS. Oh, shit. So, so Wonder Woman has a piggy. <laughs> I'd have and, a piggy. Uh, Piggies are adorable. Green Lantern's got a squirrel. But I love squirrels, too, though. Flash has a turtle. <gasps> I love turtles. And um I like dogs. Is that what is that supposed to be? I like turtles. What is this one supposed to be? Is that an evil hamster? I don't know what the hell I'm looking at. I, I don't know no what that is either. Looking. Naked mole rat. Oh, here we go. Here we go. All right, so crypto, crypto the super dog. Yes, I know crypto. Yep, and Superman are inseparable best friends. They share the same superpowers and fight crime in Metropolis side by side. Superman and the rest of the Justice League are kidnapped. Crypto must convince a ragtag shelter pack. Ace the hound. PB the pot-bellied <laughs> pig, Merton the turtle, I love it, Merton. and Chip the squirrel. So that's a hound? The other thing was supposed to be a it's hound? It's Bat-Hound. That's, that's Batman's dog. Oh. Well, I like dogs, so it works for me. That's no, and the, what's this thing up here, though? I don't know. I think it's a freaking... That's what I can't figure out. Hamsterville from from Lilo and Stitch. I don't know what that is. Anyway, um, notice who's missing from this poster. Cyborg. Cyborg's missing. Now he is on here. Now this is this is what got everybody's attention. Cyborg looks absolutely freaking ridiculous. It does look ridiculous for a number of reasons. One, why does he have a freaking wheel here? He'd snap in half. Let's be honest here. But like the half afro, right? So just so you know, um, in the comics, Cyborg does have hair. Mm -hmm. uh, he does not on on uh, Teen Titans. They shaved his head, I think, just to make it easier to animate or whatever. Probably. But, uh, you know, when I was growing up, Cyborg always had hair. That being said, Cyborg did not have a freaking half an afro. Uh, but half row, if you will. A half row. A half row. Um, no, I do think that the whole reason behind this, to me, is because this here. It's, the a, blade? The, it's a balance thing. Maybe that's his pet. His hair is his pet. Oh, that would be glorious. That would be kind of cool. If if you, you, he could, like, take the afro, the half row it's, off. It's like a, like a, actually a groundhog or something. Yeah, you it's know? like a groundhog. Or a hedgehog and, or something. And it warms his head. Um, no, I think it's more to do with the fact that they're trying to visually balance it by doing that. Because um, if you take that off, it visually is unba unbalanced right here. I, I But I can't get past the fact he's going to snap in half. I like some of the comments here. Uh, this is coming from Alan. Alan, because there's only one Alan on, on Twitter. It's Alan. Yeah, Batman just look messed up. The girls are fine. Why did Cyborg, why did they do Cyborg so dirty? And Batman, why does he look cracked up? 
shut up, it's a movie for kids, my God. Oh, yes, you're not allowed to have an opinion, but they can have their opinions. <laughs> yeah, there we go. You. <laughs> Your walls. Okay, that's good. I like that. <laughs> I, I get that. That's. It smells like I farted. See, I said take a crap, but, you know, it's not just me. I'm not alone. He's the Bruce is loose. <laughs> Bruce is loose. So here's here some of the uh, here's some of the quote tweets on this. Uh, again, these designs have been out there. I had, I haven't seen Cyborg yet. I had seen Batman, and um, I saw the trailer. It didn't look terrible. I mean, it's a kids movie. It's got Keanu Reeves in it. Yeah, I'm um, not gonna go watch it. So it the half me. afro. They made Jessica and Diana uneffable. This movie's. I don't cut. think she looks that bad. I don't think she's terrible. Batman looks like fried yes. ASF and Cyborg. Yeah, girlies ate them up and down. Oh, he's got a half row. See, see, okay, yes, yeah, see, half row. Bro, Cyborg be going every day, every day but leg day. Uh, the effing half row. Okay, yeah, I feel vindicated here. It's not just me. It probably is an actual term. Who knows? What they do to my boy? What they yeah. do, my boy? At least they didn't put a pick in his hair or something. No, don't give them ideas. Uh, why is Cyborg built like a girl from One Piece? Why does Batman look like that? Dog A to B. <laughs> oh. No, I'm serious. That's probably what he did. Dog A to B. That's what happens when a dog eats a B. My dog stepped on the B? No, dog A to B. Cyborg's design is what happens when you don't get enough black people in the room. Ooh. I'm not disagreeing. I'm not disagreeing with that. I'm not either. The Super Pets design team. Mm -hmm. uh, the Grubhubization of American content. Kinda, yeah. Fire the character designer. Cyborg is literally Frankie Man. Giving Cyborg half an afro got to be the most egregious shit I've ever seen. I think it looks fucking stupid. It does. Yeah, everybody's called it half afro. See, half -row. I, f I feel so vindicated. They're agreeing with me on Batman and half row, and I have not seen any comments around this. I hadn't had time to look. Good God. Not even joking. I can make better designs than this. Half row. How they blackface a black guy. <laughs> Half afro is insane. They look horrible. Half afro is sending me so bad. What is this? What is this? Okay, so yeah, apparently everybody just got the memo that mm -hmm. this is coming out. Um, and you notice a lot of people who are upset about it, not white. Not white people. Can you imagine? This isn't the representation you want. You don't want this ridiculous hair. You don't want to be stereotyped. <laughs> I can't. Is he gonna like? It looks like he's got a wheel in his pelvis. Does he turn into like freaking Gizmo Duck or something? <laughs> like, is he gonna wheel around? Is he gonna yeah. say booyah? Oh, probably not, say booyah. I wouldn't be surprised. You gotta do booyah, even though Ray Fisher really didn't want to say booyah. What they do to Cyborg? Yeah, it's not hard to get Cyborg right. Cyborg's not hard to get no. right. No, they've actually gotten Cyborg right-ish in live action a couple of times. Mm -hmm. There are lots of references. Cyborg's been around for a very long time. Contrary to what people think. Cyborg oh, yes, has, yes. has been around for a very long no, time. Ah, diversity was only invented a few years ago. Yeah. Um, lots of lots of ways you could have gone that didn't look ridiculous, but good luck with that. Good luck with it's that. It's for the children. Think of the children, but don't think of the children too much. No, don't think of the, it, they, they say think of the children, but they're the ones that are gonna go see the movie. Not the that, children. That is true. Uh, more adults are probably going to... I don't know. This hamster one, thing is. I think it's... Is that Lex Luthor's hamster? Is it an evil hammy? Evil hammy? A damster. Damster. <laughs> I do like animals, though. I love turtles and pigs and squirrels. So, you know, and doggos. And whatever the hell that the hamster thing is. I'm sure he's cute. When did Wonder Woman have a pig? Is that in the comics? I don't remember Wonder Woman. I don't know, but I think it's funny it's a pig because Wonder Woman's like, you know, beautiful and thin and she has a pig. She has a pig. Even though I'd have a pig as a pet. Pigs are so cute. They are, but then I really would feel bad about eating pork because I don't want to eat. We don't eat much of that anyway. No, I know, but I would eat a we lot We used to, of but Squid King is anti-pig products at this point. Yes. Long story. It's a long story. It's not a religious conversion Invol or anything. Involving biology class. So, yeah, we don't eat pork very much. But I do like pot -bellied pigs. They're so cute. And tasty. Mostly cute. Mostly cute. Anyway, we're going to wrap this up. Yes. Please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. We'll talk later. Bye.
now he's just tasty, delicious, rotten flesh meat, which I can consume and don't read into it too much. Just like our museum, the cafe, it's open to brute through it, eager to serve. I don't think this was in the show. Run, 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 run. Oh, you got splatted. No. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh she was begging and what? you kicked her in the face. I don't care. Hey guys, Squid King here, and today we're in a- Not girl boss, not girl boss at all. She is not a material girl. She is not. Oh, it's Christmas time here in your mom. Nobody wants to join your mom. What? Like I can't even cook kid cuisine right. I would last about two minutes with Gordon Ramsay. What? Where is he? He's hiding. He's hiding from you. He better. Oh my god, you got the axe. Walker, does this look like Steven Universe? Let me punch him. Well, I'm just here for the wax. Right where you belong. Get in the dirt. Well, that was a combination of events I probably shouldn't have put together. Anyways, let's open this bottle too. Chica pinata. Is that official? Oh, no. There's a bootleg. Hello. Hey guys, it's Diamond Tool. Let's make a farm. Like and subscribe and buy my merch. I mean, while you're here, you guys should like really like and subscribe and buy our merch, all of which we have. <laughs> that is true. You can't run them carrying trash. And you can get away with one F-bomb per PG-13 movie. Oh, I wish I'd yeah. known that sooner. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna wrap this effort up. Yes. <laughs>